what is basically a cause and effect sheet or cause and effect chart so what are all the basic components that is available in a cause and effect sheet and how to design a cause and effect sheet and we would detail see with a suitable example to capture the cause and effect components in this video so let's get into this video so this is basically a vessel and this vessel is being filled by a process fluid so already this vessel is being filled over here and we do have an SDV on the filling line this is a process fluid okay and it is uh, give tag number SDV 110 this is basically a random or an example tag which we are using and this particular vessel is being monitored and controlled by three pressure transmitters and basically all the three pressure transmitters or ESD transmit or safety transmitters so again we would randomly give a tag number as PSIT 101 PSIT 102 PSIT 103 okay also we are having a level transmitter which is again a safety level transmitter and we would give tag number as 101 finally we are having a suction line to a pump okay so this pump would uh, discharge the process fluidity to another section okay and we would uh, name this pump as P101 and again in the suction line we are having a dedicated pressure transmitter and uh, we would name this as PSIT104 okay all are random tag numbers for an example purpose only now I am going to explain you the protection systems available for this particular vessel okay so this vessel tag number can be 101 okay so how we are going to protect this particular vessel see I have considered only the safety or ESG tags by default we would be also having DCS tags for alarm trend and other monitoring purpose for this example cost number sheet I have taken only the safety or ESG tags so all the three pressure transmitter is having a trip of high high so when PS high charge high high trip would be initiated by the transmitters 101 102 103 so we have given a trip logic such a way that two out of three voting would trip the main incomer SDV 110 okay so this is basically one of the trip initiation to protect the vessel and next would be the level transmitter so for this I have considered LS high charge high high level and low low level both so again I am going to derive the example over here so level high high of 101 the voting logic is one out of one because we do have only one single transmitter and level low low L has L L101 again this is with one out of one voting see when there is adequate process fluid it can give an good suction or head to this pump if the level falls low the pump might get uh, all the suction and it may go dry run or starvation that would uh, damage the pump that is why level low low we are tripping the pump P101 and finally we are having a, a trip initiation by this PSIT 104 which is in the suction line and we are having only PSL only low low so pressure low low in suction line PSIT 104 again would be having a trip logic of 1 out of n would trip the pump to protect or from damage so this is basically the 
control systems or trip initiators to protect the particular vessel okay how to capture this particular trip or control philosophy in cost and effect sheet so let's get into the cost and effect sheet now this is basically a cost and effect sheet okay and this is an excel sheet for an easy understanding basically cost and effect sheet will have a drawing number and i have randomly given x x x y y y 1023 depending upon the organization or engineering design they would go any uh, drawing number to identify the particular cost and effect sheet so the horizontal column or the presence the cost column these are all the causes and the vertical column would represent the effect column and what are all the components available in the cost column we have p and id tag number description trip tag and logics again in effect column we have action tag number description and p and id so basically we are randomly giving on p and id number uh, p iphone 101 iphone b iphone 101 okay there is no explanation for this p and id this is a random number i am giving okay as per the control philosophy trip philosophy of this equipment first we are taking psit of 101 102 and 103 okay so we are taking these three pressure transmitters and the description of this particular pressure transmitter is vessel pressure okay and the trip tag for this particular pressure transmitter is psh h 101 102 and 103 and already we have given the uh, logic such a way that it acts upon two out of three voting okay so this is basically the cost column we have already described you that pressure high high two out of three should trip the sdvs okay and uh, the tag number of sdv is sdv iphone 110 and again this is coming in the description of vessel pressure or vessel inlet okay and finally uh, both will share the same p and id okay so hope you understood one uh, suitable example so refer this particular vessel and this is how we have captured the cost and effect sheet for one particular trip initiation now quickly we'll go through the other uh, cost and effect sheet for the trip initiation so this is the causes and this is the effect okay so i think this particular diagram would give you basic idea of cost and effect sheet uh i am just giving a, a different different color to identify different different uh, causes so bear with me it would be very easy for you to understand this okay okay so basically i think you could have easily understood how we have designed a cost and effect sheet for a particular vessel protection control philosophy so this is basically an easy cost and effect sheet hope you got a very good understanding over here if you like this video please hit the like button and share to the simulation community if you want to watch such instrumentation video do subscribe to our channel learn instrumentation engineering youtube channel thank you